What's around everyone? How are y'all doing during this airy season, right? I'm coming to you now to give you your Aries reading, right? And now we're fully into Aries. We're nine degrees in to Aries. What's around all you Aries people? Happy solar return. Happy flight day to you, right? This is a wonderful time for you to start creating new things, right? Initiating new things, starting new stuff, doing new stuff, right? No matter what, Aries could account about that. No matter what, no matter who's there, who's watching, where you at, what time of day it is, Aries be Aries. <laughs> so Aries, Sun, Moon, Ascendants, how y'all doing out there? Oh, wow. So this is the energy for you. You know, I have to come to you today, today, today. Today is my day to speak to you, right? To tell you what energies are you manifesting in, okay? What energies are you creating in? What energies are you planting your seeds in? What kind of seeds you're creating over there, huh? I want to know. All right, comment below. What you creating over there? What's new? What's popping? <laughs> All right. All right, so this is going to be your Aries reading. So whatever zodiac sign I talk about, that's for Aries sun. Um, wherever your sun is at, wherever your moon is at, and whatever your um, ascendant is when it comes to the Aries placements, right? I'm also going to be talking about each zodiac sign. So your zodiac sign, Gemini, you know, zodiac sign, Cancer, zodiac sign, Pisces. But it goes for the sun, moon, and ascendant of that sign. So if you're Gemini sun, moon, and ascendant, that would apply for that Gemini reading. If you're Aries sun, moon, and ascendant, either one of those, that would apply for the Aries reading. All right, so let's get into what does these cards really want to talk all right what energies are you manifesting in Ooh. what's around libra sun moon ascendance this is your reading for aries season well where you going with all that fire you just tapping in with the fire plus your air side with all that air and community and you tell well you could be talking positive or talking negative one or the other but either way it's coming out real passionate, right? People can talk passionate and talk positive things, right? And people can talk negative and negative things happen. Now, this is Libra that we talk about. Oh, my goodness. Libras, listen, Will Smith is a Libra, if y'all didn't know. That's a perfect example how some passions <laughs> and feelings can come out and be directed in, in, in that way. I don't care if they sit up there and try to say it was fake, it was fun. No, 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 no. Mm -mm. Stop. Okay? The energy was there, right? We all felt that energy. I don't care how good of an actor or actor. Oh, he was good. That, no, don't try to sweep it under the rug, okay? This was displaced anger, okay? <laughs> That's all it was, okay? And I had a, did a video called Shadow Work um, the day before, okay, about running away your feelings and how drama, like how we have to take drama and look at it in a certain way. To, you know, but anyway, you can watch that video. So, anyway, Libras, okay, so yes, you got all this impulsiveness, you got all this action, you talking, you moving, some people punching, <laughs> slapping, but you got this energy. Some of y'all are directing it in a good way, where you're directed towards a new project, a new um, adventure that you're going on. Maybe you're going on a new vacation, and this is you ain't been on vacation in years, and you're putting all your passion and time into working and making sure you got the swimsuits for everybody. You know, you're putting your energy into all that, making sure you budget your money. That's just a, an example. Um, it could be a new hobby. It could be a new job that you say, hey, I got this new job. I'm grateful. I'm going all in because this is the job that I landed that I wanted. Um, it could be a relationship, you know, just anything that you want all in on it, like hard, okay? Um, and that's just some positive things, you know, some negative things. Like I said, you can see what Will Smith is doing 
where all that pent up aggression, pent up emotion, all that fire is being through. And he like, it, well, you can look at it, he could be in war mode. All that fire is like going for war mode and you already got to put air and fire together, okay? All right, that's what you get. Especially people who was kids and they used to play around with fire a lot. Y'all know. <laughs> Them kid pyros. Y'all know. You put air with fire. Use that shit. There's going to be a problem, right? So some problems are happening on the other end with Libras, okay? And this is kind of causing... And you might be frustrated because of some delays. You might be shut out of some things. Some things are not coming to you as fast or manifesting as fast as you want. You might be... Um, you know, just all over the place, you know, just not focused on anything, just energy everywhere. Like, let's say this, this, if this Knight of Wands card could move, all right, it's going this way, but then it's going to go turn the other way, and then it's going to, like, no real direction that you're going. It's just, you're everywhere, you know? You don't know what to put it on, what to place it on, where to blame it on. You just all in confusion and it's coming with all this passion so you might be burning down houses bridges relationships all kinds of stuff so those type of people you know it's time for you to even though and this is airy season so everybody is like impulsive but this card is saying that you are really impulsive <laughs> you really are acting in the aries energy you know um on going on adventures and you know just taking actions on your goals and your dreams and stuff and that's that good side of it but i'm talking about for the other ones who just just pin up anger and aggression and they don't know what to do with it and this that and the other you might need to get some help to learn how to channel you know your energies you know don't go to whoever will smith is going to whoever will smith is going to has failed him okay so <laughs> but you you might need to learn some techniques on how to you know deal with your inner self how to deal with channeling your your energy and focusing it on you know certain things that's going to help you know create new seeds not burn them all up where you ain't got no seeds <laughs> you know so it's a lot of working on yourself a lot of internal fire balance and if you're into like martial arts they talk about that you know how to balance that fire you know sometimes you need it hard you know you need it to be torturous like and sometimes you just need it to be a flip you know just like a flick of light and that's all you need you know so just learn how to deal with those aggressions and those moments and 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 um those delays you know maybe in in, in all things there's always a reason so you know even if you have to look at a bigger picture of why you're frustrated what is making you frustrated what is making these delays maybe it's with something within you that you gotta change not maybe it all starts with the individual everything starts with the individual everything all right so take a look at you during this Aries season because Aries is about self anyway and see you know how maybe you wasting maybe you telling somebody off every day really and the overall card for everybody is the death card maybe you need to get rid of that person because instead of you telling that person off every day imagine if you didn't imagine how much your health would be better how would you would feel better you could use that whole hour of anger and energy to be focusing on things that you want to focus on hard you, you see what i'm saying so look into that type of stuff during this airy season for those of you who are using that passion in the right direction and you, you have a direction you have a goal you keep on doing what you're doing because you're seeing it already working you're seeing it already growing um that the ventures that you're taking that it's working well, it's working for you. In, in the long run, in the short run, you see the benefits for it. So y'all keep doing what y'all doing during this airy season. Have a wonderful day. And